Barry, thanks a lot. Well, speaking of the great American solar eclipse, it is less than a week away. Arkansas's plum location in the path of totality is expected to draw hundreds of thousands of tourists here. But will this event really live up to the hype? Well, Channel 7's Kayla Christian went in search of the answer to that question today. She joins us live from the First Security Amphitheater in downtown Little Rock. Kayla. Yeah, Chris, this is expected to be a big deal, and I am here at the Amphitheater of Little Rock, just one of the many spots where thousands will be gathering for that total solar eclipse, what experts are calling a once-in-a-lifetime event. Any particular place on the planet can expect a total solar eclipse about once every 375 years. So that, that's the rarity there. Arkansas hasn't seen a total solar eclipse since 1918, which is why thousands of visitors will be entering the state, causing an impact on traffic, emergency services, and more. Be prepared, don't panic. The dramatic effect of the total, uh, so there's that interest. So that, that's one reason why people are really excited. And not only that, that attracts people. Much different from the common lunar eclipse. Those aren't as rare because if that's happening, everybody on that side of the Earth that can see the moon can see that. And the less common annular eclipse like the states had last October, and a partial eclipse like we saw in 2017. In terms of partial versus total, the big difference there is once you cover all of the disk of the sun, it's a much more dramatic effect than if some of the sun is peeking out. We had partial here back in 2017. It was 90, I think it may have been over 95% here, but it was nowhere near dramatic as it was in the path of totality. It doesn't sound like a big difference between 100% and 97%, but in terms of uh, solar eclipses, it's, it's a huge, huge difference. A total eclipse won't even be back in the path of the U.S. states outside of Alaska and Hawaii until around 20 years from now. For a lot of people, this is once in a lifetime if you don't travel. 